Hi, in this FAQ tutorial, I will be showing you how to extend a composition. For example, right here, we have the modern parallax slideshow and we have these six images right here that are actually moving into each other. But let's say if you open up one of these images, we can see that this is currently five seconds long. Okay, so if you want to change this duration, you can go to settings here and then change the duration. The only problem is that it doesn't change the composition within the composition and the compositions within those compositions. So it's a lot of work if we would have to do everything manually, which you could do, um, but I'm going to undo this step for a second. If you're new to After Effects, you might get scared from this part, but actually we need to install some scripts. We have to install the RD scripts and they're actually for free. So we're going to learn more and download the RD scripts. Once you have downloaded your scripts, you should get something like this. If we open up the RD scripts, you will see all the scripts available from their um, package. So what we will do is select this folder, right click and go to copy. And then we're going to this computer, open your program files, go to Adobe and go to the correct After Effects version. So for me, that's 2020. I'm going to support files, going to scripts here. And for a Mac, that will be different, but you can just easily uh, Google how to install scripts on After Effects and you will just get the right link on how to get there. And then right once you're in this folder, you can right click and paste these scripts. So I'm going to continue here and there we go. So now in After Effects, if I go to file and I go to scripts, we don't see anything yet. So I have to restart After Effects. Let me do that for a second. All right. So now we are back in After Effects and we'll go back to our main composition and open one of these images. So right here, we will go to file, go to script. And now you will see all these new scripts added. We want to take a look at the RD Comp Setter. Just ignore all the other ones for now, but they're super useful once you get more into After Effects. So once you click that, you can here change everything. So you can change the width, the height uh, and stuff like that, but also the duration. Currently it's set to frames, but we can also change it to seconds. So it's five seconds. Let's say we wanted 15 seconds and apply. Now we can close this. And you will see that we have now a composition of exactly 15 seconds and it will actually increase everything in duration. So now if we go back to this composition, once we go over five seconds, it's still gone. So we don't see our image. That's because we have this overlay solid. So if we're going to press U on the keyboard, you will see all the keyframes for that animation. So right here it animates in and right here it animates out. What we want to do is select these keyframes and just move them over to wherever we want to animate out our image. And now if we're going to preview this, we have a very long animation. So that's looking great. One thing we could also do is just go over here and extend the composition for these. These are also changed to 15 seconds, but just because I offsetted them, uh, they're not long enough. So what I can do is either jump into them or just extend the time a little bit more uh, and then just shorten it afterwards. And then just shorten it afterwards. So I'm going to jump into these compositions and just go to composition settings, increase the time where needed, and then we can just uh, do it like that. And then you see it's affecting this right here. And there we go. So that's all the compositions. And now we have an extended layer. All right. So I hope this tutorial was helpful and I'll see you in the next one. Take care and goodbye.